I remember Jay Z saying something along the lines of like they got these youngins putting out shit at young ages when their minds are still developing. You know, uh, if I'm not mistaken, he put out his first shit at like what, twenty nine, twenty seven, something like that. Don't don't quote me, but it was somewhere around there. And it's just like, yeah, I believe in, uh, you know, multiple lives in one body. And, um, yeah, just that perspective keeps me optimistic. I remember when you guys performed at Fallon, Questlove put in a call to Jay-Z, and Jay-Z said he met with you guys. Did you ever have one-on-one? One-on-one, no. (laughs) But uh, we did meet at his house. He said Beyonce was there, but she never came out. <laughs> so I, don't, I don't know. But we had tacos. And uh, it was pretty cool. Like, I had a moment. Like, I was drink, having a Corona at the infinity pool, looking at the view. And I remember I was sitting by myself for a minute, and Jay was like, look at this nigga. He having a moment. <laughs> Everybody just started laughing. And it's just like, yeah, nigga. I'm having a moment. And once I leave, I'm going to have another one. (laughs) You know? These moments don't stop. Like, they just keep coming. And I'm inviting them at this point. Was he he just trying to talk to you guys, or was he trying to court you guys for a specific opportunity? Yeah, he was trying to pick us up, put us us on his Maybach bandwagon. And uh, the opportunity was nice, you know? It's cool to it's cool to also be um, the freedom of decision in within you know within our opportunity. Yeah, everything worked out as it should have. I think so. I would I would say so.